wonderful experience to come out to the different types of venues in Union County, uh, Plainfield, uh, Summit, and now Westfield. Um, I, I know we get out to many events and, and see the town, and, and Westfield is a tremendous community um, that I often visit myself and with my family, and they're great parks, great downtown, and uh, this was a really good idea to come out and see the residents and give opportunities and opportunity to talk and see what's going on. Um, with their county government. Uh, to uh, many of the individuals who are here tonight to discuss the cell phone tower in Cranford, um, I, I join you in saying that I too have just learned of, of this tower um, through your emails uh, because it was not certainly, it was certainly not something that was on our radar because it's not something that we are uh, tasked with approving or citing. Uh, what I would say is, in terms of our relationship, uh, you have representatives here this evening from the college. They, I'm sure, will be here after the meeting. You can certainly speak to them. And I know that the county manager um, will also be reaching out uh, to the president of the university as well as uh, you know, the appropriate folks to talk about that. Um, and then I'm sure there will be a, a zoning process and a planning process that will be done through the township, and they'll have to get requisite in that manner. Uh, so there's there certainly is a, a process that has to be filed. Is, you, you know, we can't, you know, just when we were talking about the stairwell, um, we don't, uh, you know, with uh, the courthouse project, we don't uh, have the ability just to do whatever the heck we want on county property. We still have to go to the city of Elizabeth and must approve our construction decision. So there's still um, an oversight that has to be done to the college, and I'm sure the college will do due diligence, and I'm sure the people of Cranford will have their opportunity to speak uh, to that. Um, in, in regard to the need for communication, and that's, I, I know that that's the college's argument, and I think it's a compelling one, um, and working in, the, in a university where I work at Kane uh, during the day, and we have many new buildings, many old buildings, and even as we add repeaters, and there are new towers put up, cell phone is, service is spotty, and that is an issue. Um, you know, certainly from a first responder standpoint, but also from the way that, you know, society as a whole, education in particular, is evolving. Things have become more wireless, more paperless. People are using more cell service. Even as we look at the county college, um, there's also next to Nomi Higgins Park where we provide cell service because people enjoy the service. And there's going to be a, not a need for less capacity, but more capacity. I have no idea about this tower and how that fits into the grand scheme of things, but there certainly should be due diligence and you certainly should participate through you know, the proper planning and I'm sure we will be kept at bay and we will be made uh, aware of that progresses and I'm sure we'll hear back if there's a role we can play in that. Um, 